Hey Conway High, I'm Marcus McCullough. And I'm Caleb Eli, and we're here with your WTGR Tiger News. All right, you guys, 23 days till spring break and 53 until summer. Let's hang in there. We'd like to say congratulations to the Tiger Robotics team on their great success at the competition this weekend. Our Tigers finished 21st overall and third in Norrie County. Great job, guys. Don't forget, if you have an FA on your first semester report card, to pick up a sheet in the attendance office for one of the makeup dates, March 11th and 18th. Also, ASVAB testing is on March 16th in the mini auditorium. If you wish to take this test, sign up in guidance, and don't forget there's tutoring on Tuesdays in room A205. Seniors, make sure you're paying attention to any different programs and scholarship opportunities. We'd like to wish our beloved Spanish teacher, Mr. Lynch, a speedy recovery. Get well soon. Kate Cientas Mejor. This weekend, Conway High School was represented in all state choir at Winthrop University in Rock Hill. These students that attended were Ray Stone, Heather Orton, Savannah Turner, and Tyreek Jackson. We would like for you to support a Conway High School alumni, Gustavo Guerrero, and his cover of Switchfoot's Only Hope, with Switchfoot's front man, John Foreman, introduces the video. Conway Tigers do great things even after they leave these hallowed halls. To see the video, search Gustavo Guerrero Only Hope on YouTube. And now, here's some other announcements. I'm at a Boys State. Boys State is open to rising senior male students. Deadline is March 10th. Nathan Wolf, Law Enforcement Academy. The academy is open to male and female students ages 16 through 18. Application deadline is March 10th. These are the rest of the scholarships with March deadlines. SC Educational Foundation, March 15th. Emmett Kelly Determination Scholarship, March 17th. Pulver Green Project, March 17th. SCA EAP, March 24th. Democratic Women's Council SA, March 31st. Arbor One SA, March 31st. And Tideland Hospice, March 31st. Please go to the Conway High School website, check the guidance page for more details on these scholarships and more available with April deadlines. And now to Luke and Jonna with the Sports Report. Hi, I'm Jonna. And I'm Luke here with the WTGR News. The boys' varsity soccer team lost 5-1 at home Friday against St. James, and the girls' varsity soccer team lost against the Sharks at St. James. The girls' next game will be home on Wednesday, and the boys will play away. They will face St. James for a second time, so good luck, Tigers. That's it for today, Conway High. Back to Caleb and Marcus. Today's feature is on the sounds and sights from the robotics competition, brought to you by Mac Hux, Graham Carter, and Cameron Millis. <laughs> So this
this is the gear mechanism. This is where the gear comes down, and then Marshall drives up and loads gears. This is the shooter for the high goal, and uh, this is the hopper where the balls go in. And then if you look inside there, there's an agitator to stir the balls up. And then on the other side is the winch for the primer. Awesome. How much time have y'all put into this? Uh, seven days a week for six weeks. And we stay till like 7, 8 o'clock every night. That's all for your WTGR student news today, Tigers. Remember, I'm Marcus McCullough. And I'm Caleb Eli. Signing off for your WTGR student news. Remember, life's like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. Stay classy, Conway.